What's up everybody, Zevin here, and today we're playing Hot Pot of Horrors from Loom North. It's a little lightweight five minute, um, I guess, horror game uh, developed and published by Loom North. Once again, I enjoyed the uh, conversations with Cannibals game that they had, so I wanted to try the rest of what they had in their uh, library. So uh, we do got, uh, but this one basically, um, it's a free five minute game on Itch.io. It uh, says here you got one pot, five minutes, and two different endings. Uh, the storm rages. It's a school night, but you have a debt to pay, and the hot pot waits for no one. So let's go ahead, jump in, and see how it goes. How'd it go? 91%. Thank you so much. That's amazing. I'm happy I could help. Please let me know if you ever need help. I owe you one. Actually, now I have a, uh, actually, now I have a project I could use some help on if you have time. Yeah, of course. Which class, though? Because I don't know if I'll be useful. Ha ha ha. You'll be useful, sir. Don't worry. Oh, you'll be useful for sure. Don't worry. You can come over like 9 p.m. tonight. Isn't that kind of late? Thought you said you wanted to help. Sad face. If you were just saying that, then forget it. It's fine. No, 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 no. No, I, I, mean, I meant it. It's fine. I'll be there. Heart emojis, heart reaction, no heart reaction. There we are. Uh, recipe, I guess. Hi, thanks for coming over. Sorry, I was a bit vague. Some people might be weirded out. It's kind of a niche hobby. Basically, I'm really into energy experiments. I believe that we can influence positive outcomes in our lives through intentionality and ritual. It's kind of silly, but it really empowers me. I have all the recipes written out. I just need some assistance. A, sh a sous chef. I'll, I'll, I'll be a sous chef, sure. Whoa, what the heck? Oh no, I put the... I, I messed up, guys. Let's cook it. We just made everything. Okay, cool. It does restart itself. That's good to know. So it looks like we got some cilantro. Looks like we got some green onions, some sage, some, uh, I guess, stinging nettles. I don't know. Lemon. Okay. So here's our recipes here. Sage to heal existing wounds. Salt to protect me from danger soon. Okay. So sage and salt. Oh no. Not that recipe. We don't need to we don't need a protection spell. It'll seal us off. Phew, okay, the hot pot wasn't plugged in. Let me fix that. Slow down a second. Let me get all the ingredients we'll need first. Alright, let's do it. Sorry about that. We really don't we don't really need that spell. We're gonna try to and communicate with some lost friends of mine. Don't worry. Just follow my instructions. Can you check that recipe again? Oh shit, the wolf's eyes opened. Oh no! We got a skeleton hand and a ring where the sage used to be, huh? Now we got matches. It's October, so that's cool. We'll throw some pumpkins in there. A single match unlit and unused. A fruit from the season. Bloody but unbruised. Uh, okay, what would that be? A perfect circle, broken and exposed. We boil these offerings and declare ourselves unclosed. So we need a single match, a fruit from the season, bloody but unbruised, and a perfect circle. So we need a match. Um, a fruit from the season that's bloody but unbruised. So, uh, do we go with this one since it's darker? Or do we go with an apple. I don't know if apples... Let's try the pumpkin. And then the ring, obviously, right? Uh-oh, here we go. Oh, that was not it. That was not it, okay. Let's try the apple. Because nobody likes the bruised apple anyways. Oh, shit. Oh, wait, what's this? 
One, I was trying to catch that bird. A matchstick? Is there a tomato somewhere? This paper's getting bloodier and bloodier, though. Bloody butt unbruised. Oh, so if, what if we do this then? Why did it do that? No! See, these are bruised. You can see they're bruised. So it's definitely not going to be those. This is going to be wrong. I was trying to drag it over to here to maybe make it bloody. I don't know how to make it bloody. Um, That would be it. Can I move it up over this way? And then make it bloody? How do I make it bloody, though? So, I, was, so I don't know. Because... As you can see, it's red, unbruised, right? Which would be bloody and unbruised. We got the matchstick. And we got the ring. Do I need to combine them? No. A find a matchstick, a red apple, a piece of a broken plate. Piece of a broken plate, okay. I I, I was thinking the, the, the ring, right? That's like an, a never an unending circle. Okay. So we got the match. I never would have picked the plate as an, an unending, basically, ring, right? A circle. I mean, circles are always unending. There's no beginning or end to a circle. Um, I'm going to put them in, in the order it says to as well. But I never would have picked a plate. Never in a million years would I pick a plate. Oh, shit. The window's opening. Uh, do you see that behind you? <laughs> Even the freaking wolf's eyes got big for a second. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, looks like we got an elf on a shelf. Better be careful. Or else he's going to let Santa know. And then we ain't getting shit for Christmas. Um, we got a, a mask. This is amazing. I've never gotten that reaction before. I knew you were the right person to ask. Are you okay? Don't worry. I was the one that closed the window. Yeah, but it's open. You're good, right? Because I know exactly what to do next. I've read about this. Let's do the next one. Okay, let's do the next one. All right, so we collected the face of a queen, the lungs of a body that no long that's no longer green. The lungs of a body that's no longer green. This, a dead plant, right? Because it does breathe through its leaves. The meat that let us watch and see, so the eyeballs. Come inside and share this tea. So the face of a queen, uh, right here. The lungs of a body that is no longer green. Uh, the meat that let us watch and see. And come inside and have this tea. I don't see tea, so I'm assuming that's all we need. Wait. Oh shit, dude. Woohoo! Wee! That was. Give me the bat. Oh shit, look at the elf, dude. Look how close he got. His eyes are stitched and his mouth is stitched. His eyes and mouth are stitched shut. And we got a bat floating around in his beach. I dug out some more ingredients for the next recipe. It's a big one. Which one do we need? Uh, we need the blood from a vampire hidden in plain sight, so the bat. The teeth from a victim of a wolf's bite. Okay. Uh, with the wings from a fairy and the ears from the Mary. So there's his ear, the fairies, the bat, and the teeth. Right? And I'm going to put them in, in that order. So the blood, the teeth, the fairy. The blood, the teeth, the fairy, and the Mary. Okay. So let's go. The blood, the teeth, the fairy, and the and the Mary. And we got a gallon of milk. Do we need some moo juice in there? Or we need some of that healthy glass of moo juice. It's good for your bones. Okay, that didn't work. Wait. There's the teeth from the wolf spite. Um a vampire hidden in plain sight. 
so no, that was right then. So that, uh, that, and that. Wait. That recipe requires a second step. No, no, I got this one. Allow me. With this lock of witch's hair. Oh, we're a witch. Makes sense. Oh, shit, bro. Yo. Take command of this mortal all in... I've, I've ensnared. Oh, shit. We were trapped, dude. So, this bitch decided... Oh, I'll help you with your schoolwork so I can fucking feed you to a monster. God damn it. <laughs> what a bitch. What a bitch. Uh, uh, take command of this mortal, I've... Yo, fuck yeah, dude. Look at that. You know, I did really enjoy studying with you. Too bad you've never studied witchcraft. Or maybe you'd know a protection spell to save yourself. I do, though. I do. Fuck, it was, um, Sage? Oh, well, my sister needs a physical form. And you owe me a debt. Fair's fair. Okay, we need Sage... We need, um, shit, what was it? Uh, Sage, uh, we don't have it, do we? No, get out of there, get out of there. But we needed to Sage. <gasps> Yo, we broke his fingers, dude. Nice. So I don't know, now, that was fun. We're gonna play it again. I wanna see if I get the second ending. I'm not gonna protect myself, but Sage has always been used as like a thing to ward off evil spirits and stuff, right? By like witches and hippies and things. So let's go ahead, I wanna play it again. Copy the game link and follow me on Twitch. Okay. Or itch. Yeah, itch. Um. Two, 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 two. All right, yeah. Here, we're gonna go ahead and start this one over. Give me one second here. You ain't getting me this time, sister. Let's go. Got the protection spell. Yo, what? A protection spell? Ugh. I can't believe you remembered that. Well, I didn't, but <laughs> we had to do a second chance. <laughs> Great. My coven is already furious that I turned Riley incorporeal. We're supposed to be 13 witches, they said. It's auspicious. It's sacred. Blah, blah, blah. I think they just think 13 sounds cool. What a waste of time. Well, actually, we can be friends. That's pretty impressive magic back there. Any chance you want to join a coven? Fuck yeah, I do. Let's go. Let's go. Well, I had a ton of fun with that. That was super, super fun. I do want to thank my son, Elder Dragon. That's his YouTube channel name anyways. I want to thank him. He was the one that pointed out that it was sage and salt to me. Um, that I forgot the salt. Or he was one to point out that there was a salt on the table because I, I couldn't find it at all. Um, I got, I got, I got, I guess stun locked. <laughs> but anyways, I had a lot of fun with this. Uh, but this, we're going to go ahead and end this one. Uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys thought about it. Like I said, it's free on itch.io right now. Um, but yeah, this is where we're ending it. So thank you guys for stopping by. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, you guys have yourselves a great day.